none of it comes back to Wow, I'm gonna go to Arthur Bay today too. That looks magnificent. And I could totally snorkel by myself there. It wouldn't be too scary. Wow. This is so creepy. It's darker than it looks on the camera. And it echoes. Woo! Weird. Scary. This place feels haunted. There's another room. Oh my gosh, it's so quiet. I don't like it at all. This is quite the hike. Look at this. Oh my gosh guys, it's so hot out. That was a long hike to the fort and you can hike in there for days. So instead of wearing sandals like I did, definitely wear gym shoes. Um, another tip for you is you can also get to Florence Bay from that fort hike. So if you wanna just do that, bring your snorkel gear, which I also didn't do. So I found a way to get to Florence Bay. It is a treacherous road. It looks fine, right? It's like right at the same parking lot as the fort and it's this sharp little turn that doesn't look like a road. You go down, and there's two really bad spots. The one the one at the end, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get back up. We will see. It's kind of rough. Beat hummus. Um, I can't wait to go chill. I feel like I put in the work, put in the mental energy for the interview, put in the physical workout. It's time to chill at the beach. And snorkel. So stay tuned. Just kidding, we're gonna start with Arthur Bay Beach instead of uh, Florence. Let's do it! Guys, let's get out there! I'm so excited to actually snorkel by myself this time and not have to do a tour, but just get to be out there as long as I want and go wherever I want. There's already some snorkelers out there, so it makes me feel a little safer. I've got my sting proof clothes on. Let me just make sure I don't touch anything with my hands, I guess. All right, let's go. Go out. so murky you can't even see the bottom and it like really messes with your vision and then I got up onto the reef and it like appeared in front of me like right there but it was murky and then I saw something gigantic but I couldn't make out what it was I think it was a sea turtle but I freaked out and I swam back because I'm like yeah I can't even see what a sea turtle looks like or a fish so I think I'm just gonna swim like right off the beach and just kind of chill for a minute I'm determined to get there this is a pretty steep hill. 
and I hope I'm going the right way. There's no signs to, to Florence Bay. I just know that there's like a trail or a road that connects the two. So hopefully I'm going the right way. If not, I'm just getting a butt workout in, you know? And I got water in my ear. All right guys, that's where I just was, Arthur's Bay. I made it to Florence Bay. That is a lot of walking to get to these two beaches. It is truly worth it, but it's a lot of work. It looks a little cleaner here. I'm gonna uh, swim out there and see what happens. This water is not much better at all. Not at all. But I just saw the weirdest thing ever. And I think it was maybe a stingray. It was like this really long stick and it had stripes on it. Like a tail of a stingray, but it was like really long. I couldn't even see the stingray and then it disappeared so I knew it was alive. So I'm looking for it right now. It's so, so weird. Well guys, that was a bust. Um, so murky out there, you can't see anything, but I saw a stingray that I almost stepped on as soon as I got in the water. And then the weirdest thing, I saw a couple fish, but I saw, um, it was like this long stick, like a really long stick with like blue stripes and it almost looked like plastic. And then all of a sudden it just like disappeared. And it was long and I don't know if it was like a stingray tail but it was so long that I thought I would have seen the stingray. So I have to look that up later because I don't know what it was, but it was really weird. I'm walking to the lighthouse lookout. My legs are dead today. It has been a lot of stairs, a lot of hill climbs and stairs, and I need more water than I brought carrying this is not fun either but it's all worth it i'm only gonna be here once as far as i know i think i'm almost there <sighs> what a great place for a picnic table if only i had some food all right guys let's climb to the top i'm breaking the law right now you're supposed to use two hands Pretty tall ladder. Just don't look down. Don't look down. Don't look down. Wow. <sighs> now this is the spot. He can see everything. So yes, this is uh, Arthur Bay, I think. The next one over is Florence Bay. And I'm out of breath because I just walked through like all the woods to get there and all the mountains and then I just walked all the way out back this way to get here and I still have to walk all the way somewhere over there to get back to my car. Ah, <sighs> lots of exercise today. But there's Townsville. You can see they're doing a burn. Again, they do a lot of burns and then it just makes the air smell like smoke all day. Alma Bay eating my lunch. This is a nice bay and there's a lifeguard on duty here. There are also showers down there but they're public showers. They're like on the beach. Is that man sleeping? What is he doing? <clears throat> this is where the rock wallabies all live. You know what this girl needs to do is relax. Yes, 
relax and I'm gonna start that by going all the way down these giant rocks, yeah. But once I get to the bottom, then I'll relax. Look at this, so pretty. I found a flower. I like it. I almost fell so many times coming down this. I don't think many people come down this. I don't even know where to go. I'll wait there. I want to show you guys what I found. It's great. Look at this is what I came down. That's a lot. All right, ready? Ah! There are two signs that say that. And I'm like, okay, I'm gonna see some naked people and they better not ask me to strip down because it's not happening. Look at this place, it's kind of wild. And then Townsville's on fire again. <laughs> um, that one's huge. They're normally this big. And that one's just like a monster. The lady said that they were from like a cuttlefish or something, but this makes me think I'm not alone. Maybe somebody lives down here. You guys, I cannot stop collecting things. It's just too much fun. I was really hoping that was a shark tooth, but I don't think it is. All right, guys, looking for snakes again. The temps are a bit lower today. Um, they are already at 24 degrees Celsius. So either snakes are going to hustle out onto the road to warm up immediately, or I'm not going to see anything. 